Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Arthur and today we start our day at the Galveston Palace. This is one of the top 10 places to visit in Tehran and it used to be basically a royal residence. So it consists of uh, royal buildings, different gardens and various coffee shops. We're not gonna go inside of it because we've been here last year. Well, I'm gonna show you briefly the gardens and it's, it's very beautiful. There's lots of mosaics and stuff. Of course, if we start the day, I need to get my coffee. And as you see in this coffee shop, they're really generous, so I got lucky today. But our prime objective today is to explore the Grand Bazaar. It's the oldest bazaar in Tehran and it should be amazing because my wife told me so much about it. So let's not waste our time, let's keep going. So as you can see, the territory around the palace is very beautiful. The fountains, the birds, the flowers, very peaceful. That was a small preview for the Galveston Palace and the next place that we're gonna go to is the Grand Bazaar. See you there! So right now we're right in the beginning of uh, Tehran Bazaar. It's quite busy, as you would say, there's so many people, it's so many noises. There's like so much life in here. People are selling whatever they can. Vegetables, handcrafts, souvenirs, you name it. No, amazing experience. So that was the part with the open bazaar, now we're gonna go kinda underground, it's gonna be all covered.
Also, as you can see now, we're one of the numerous rock places, and it's just so beautiful. I assume they're all handmade. You know, the Persian carpet is really popular all over the world. So, if you want to get one, come to the uh, Grand Bazaar in Tehran. That's the place to be, and we have so many choices here. Let's have a look. I'm with the owner of the place and let's have a look here, he'll tell you what it's all about. Yeah, here we have best selection of Persian rug, but usually in Iran we have a two color carpets. City made carpet and nomadic. The carpet which are coming from the villages and countryside rural place, we call it nomadic carpet. And we have another kind of the carpet, like those are behind of you, they are coming from city, we call it city made. And difference between them is their design. For city made carpet, we have a design of paper. And producer should start to make it exactly like that map. But for nomadic carpet producer, things then start to make them a mental design or memory design. And we have a di uh, three different types. We have pure silk, silk shampoo mix, and 100% lambs. And even we have another kind of handicraft, which is coming from a desert area. We call them clean. Like those over there. And these are also very beautiful. And all of them is made by the hand. But we have a two types weaving clean and needlework. And the both is beautiful. All right. Thank you. You are welcome. <laughs> And if you're walking around and you decide on the thirsty, there's this kind of thing over here so you can just come and have some water. Easy. Since after Iran we're gonna go to Ukraine, I just wanna get some presents for my family. And over here there's some rugs. Let's go choose one. And now there is a cute mini elevator over there. We're gonna go upstairs. All right, so we're now coming upstairs, and there is like a small exhibition. Let me show you. Now we get a little bit hungry, it's lunch time and we're here at this restaurant. I can't read the name guys, but you can understand anyway, it's in the Grand Bazaar. So that's where we choose to have a lunch. Let's go check it out. And as you can see behind over here, they're like international flags. So when I got a seat at the table, the way they came in and asked me where I'm from. And guess what, I said Ukraine. And we got a flag for ourselves. And he knows Andrei Shevchenko obviously. Who doesn't? Bella? We're quite hungry. All this food is so delicious. Let's get to it. A few moments later. 
Ah, oh, it was amazing lunch. It was so much food. Are we all tired? We're gonna head home. I'm probably gonna smoke some kalyan, some hubble bubble, shisha, you name it. Alright, so after a good lunch, we came to a really nice shisha place. So we're gonna enjoy some kalyan and just relax. Alright guys, so we're back home, if you like the video, smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one, peace!